afternoon. Here we are again. I've got a uh, freight car here, and uh, I put up a video there uh, a little while, uh, about a couple weeks ago, about draft gears and how they fit in here. And I didn't have a real good picture to show you. Now I got a real good picture because the draft gear came out of this one here, and they're putting a new draft gear in it. <coughs> this uh, housing here that runs all the way to the other end of the car is called the center sill and this end this part back in here is called the sill pocket the sill pocket that's where your draft gear and yoke goes back in there this this is your uh, striker casting see this right here this is the front lugs one on each side and those shiny spots back there are the back lugs straight back that's your uh, center sill so that runs the whole length of the car so this is where your draft gear goes in all right uh, refer back to uh, the video that I put up on draft gears and I tell you a good bit of information about them um, so watch that video and you'll you'll be able to see now I don't know if most of you guys know this is that uh, this truck's up on car bodies up on jacks right now. That's all it rides on. It's that pin. This whole uh, body comes down, hole in there, and that pin goes up in the hole, and uh, that's what holds it. That's a brake linkage there. There's no chains or anything. These are called side bearings, and they hit the striker plates right there. Help keep it from rocking a lot. Okay, that's a quick one, and uh, one of these days I'll go over the uh, air brake system on these cars for you too. I got a bunch of videos I want to put up here in the future, but uh, and I'm going to uh, do another one here in the future on. Uh, truck sets too. Show you all the different parts of the truck set. Okay, that uh, this is going to take a, so you refer back to that video, like I said, on draft gears that I showed you. Uh, this is going to take a type E uh, coupler. Okay, thanks for watching and have a good day.